Ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Tetra, and welcome to another episode of All In. This is where I pick a hero in Heroes of the Storm, pick an ability, trait, or other on said hero, and I go all in on it. Today, we're playing the newest hero, Probius, and what we're going to try is... Well, we're going to do it as Starcar. The build I personally think is the best, but also just the one that is the most probe-like. We're going with the full Cannon Rush build, of course. And I will say, this is one, not the best map for it, because I don't think the skeletons below actually drop minerals to stack up my level 1 gather minerals talent, which is done by minions and heroes. For second, their team is very much auto-attack and burst-based, and I'm going to have to take Photon Barrier, so... Good chance I'm going to, you know, die, quite frankly. Uh, is Murky going to solo? Okay, that's fine. I will head down to bot then. Help my team there. Probably shouldn't have used boost, should have used it here. Oh, hey. <laughs> just, pa just, just pass Butcher on the way. Don't mind me, sir. <coughs> Get these cannons down. Begin the siege. And clear the minions. Nicely done. Oh, I want those minions. I want those minerals. Start the damage a bit. Might be able to get him. No, wait, way off, way off, way too, way too early. That's all the damage. Please don't run into me. Why would you do that? He did that on purpose. You saw him. He ran directly at me. You all saw it. <laughs> I'm not crazy. Crap. Ooh, micro. Hell yeah. I've dodged that one hard. My turret, is, my uh, cannon is actually getting zero value there. I'm gonna start pylon shuffling. Just to start with. Got some damage. Flee, 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 flee! Damn it! Yeah, being at the four lane is bad. I should really have preferred to be in the solo lane, but Murky's there, so I'm gonna have to deal. This is not a good comp. Like, our comp is entirely squishy heroes, and their comp is entirely burst heroes. We're kind of effed. But, uh, we'll see. I mean, we have the two lowest health heroes in the game in the form of Murky and uh, Pro uh, Probius. Uh, it's really Vikings, of course, but Vikings, I believe their hit points add up to. A bit more than a regular hero, so... Eh. Alright, they've killed my pylons because they suck. Alright, so I'm thinking I'm going to stay up top at least to start with to try and get us level 4. That might be a good place to start. Hey, Zeratul, I see you. Oh, do it. Okay, Harass harassment will do. Let's just dump this right here at the entrance. And we're not going to go in because they're all going to be sitting there. Oh, hey, Samara. Yep, they were. Get them, get them, turret. Come up again, please. Do it again, cowards. And they backed up. Okay, we'll head in. We'll attempt to fight. Thank you, turret. Okay. Like, this, is, this is the issue with Probius. Uh, it takes him a little bit to get set up. Which could be very problematic. Uh, especially with the... Uh, how long... Uh, long a cooldown. His... Uh, Especially how long cooldown his uh, pylons are. There we go. I just completely brain uh, blanked there. I'm going to drop that down because we need protection. Okay, and once again, I now have nine seconds before I'm even useful again. I can like W and Q, but I'm going to burn it out of mana very, very fast. Uh, I'm almost definitely dead. No, I lived. Hooray. Pylons dead. Uh, yep. Yeah. No, it missed. But I'm still going to get a kill. Get a, get a shot. Damn it. <laughs> I was so close. Well, I got a kill, but everyone died except Murky. And I think Murky actually died and just went back to his egg. Well, this sucks. This is exactly what I thought would happen. It's going to suck the entire game. You may never see this game, quite frankly. Because this is going to be BS in every sense. Uh, I don't think we can fight underneath. Looks like we're going to try. Maybe. We're heading in the direction. Murky's going to be murky. Nicely done, Fred. Oh, denied. Damn, that sucks. That would have been really nice if people were able to do that. All right, well, they finished mine, so I guess we can probably get this. There we go. Good damage that time. I, I haven't got minerals for a while, though, and that's super annoying. Damn, Lucio with the aggression. Okay, this is the defensive lane. I wasn't enraged for the mid for the freaking minerals there, but yes. Alright, let's uh back up and set up. Get my get my pylon down at minimum. And then we can start blowing this thing up as it spawns. Okay. 
And boop. And there. And now we can get mana. Excellent. I missed. I suck. But I can still get it. There we go. Good damage. Moki is actually really good in terms of defense. Like, if you're fighting over an area, then the value is pretty damn good just due to the insane damage output of the uh, QW combo. That's always a lovely bit of value. Pew pew. Final shuffle. Tower defense. Ooh, lovely damage. Lovely jubbly damage. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. F you. Super solid damage. Turret. Finish it off. Grab the minerals. Because I haven't got any of those for so long. Good lord. 22 out of 70. I am doing terribly in terms of stacking. But right now I'm not being murdered, so that's good. And that's how I expected this game to go. Just full murder. Ding, ding, ding. God, that's satisfying sound. So glad that exists. We can finish this off, I guess. Yeah, you can deal with that turret. Thank you. Now, they're not actually roaming down here. They're still pushing top. That's actually really... Damn, I am just the worst. I'm just going to take the damage. There we go. I'm going to shuffle forward with another turret. Which appears to be prioritizing Butcher, which is nice. Two shots here, and boom! That's some damage! That's a lovely bit of damage. Tower defense already set me up for resets. Uh, I can get these. One shot. Yep, that isn't so bad. Should we flee? Are we, are we fine? We're fine. Man up a deal. Like, I, we know Top's dying, so at least let's trade. We can't really defend it. Especially not without a murky egg anymore. We can... Oh, hello. Hopefully I get it. Nope. Turret, go! Do something! Ah, oh, so close. Worth a try. Worth a try. This is why I backed up straight away, but Ariel didn't react in time, and then I died trying to save. Oh, well. Mistakes were made. They shall be forgiven. Trill? Trill? Kill her? <laughs> yes, good job. Good job, Mucky. Alright, so we are actually, we're actually ahead in terms of structure damage, but we're behind in terms of levels. Right, weaponized pylons. Because if we're going to go for this whole tower defense style, then of course we're going to need to uh, you know, defend the towers. And if they can defend themselves, that's going to make that job. Much easier. Move in and pick these up ASAP because the turret will handle them and Zeratul could come steal them at any moment. This is the biggest concern. Let's hit the double here. Make sure that super dies. Got him. Did not need the turret for that. Apparently that just one shots. Hello enemy team. You around here? I want to see if I can bait them into, into pylon range if I can. No, they don't appear to be a... Uh... Oh, hello. There we go. Yep, that's going to... That sorts everything out. No, don't aggro it. We want them to aggro it. Oh, that, that shuffled over a little bit. Can we pull them over here, please, so I can actually get value? Anyone? No, they're keeping it over there in the corner. All right, pile them over here. Oh, that's unfortunate. None of that. I am dying. And I missed all of my cues. Boss, please, no. Boss, no. <sighs> I'm alive. Turret down. Well, we sort of just killed everything. I have no idea what happened in that fight because I completely lost myself. Like, like, by, like, easy loss. Just didn't see myself for ages. Okay, well, we killed everything. I will take it. Pylon overcharge. Getting the value. We get those extra shields on our pylons now as well, which is always nice. Uh, so, are we going to defend? No, we should attack, surely. We're on 80. Yeah. Let's get going. Making my way over to here, see if we can take this. Oh, I'm so low on minerals. 44 out of 70. I'm just over, like, I'm just over two-thirds of the way there. I'll get there. I will get there. Ow. Okay. Need to get in range to make these minerals. 
Nice, there we go. Saving my abilities at this point, because we're already pushing up and nothing's really stopping us. Taking a little bit of damage. Ow. Cocktail, please. Why? Okay, lovely stacks. 55. We're working our way in. We're running out of mana, though, so we're going to have to pile on, but we're at their base now, so perfect. First turret. Down. Shield battery. Definitely the better talent here, in my opinion. I want these. Excuse me. Coming through. Pylon shuffle continues. Oh, hey. Hey. Hey, Zara. Goodbye. Get it! Yes! Pylon overcharge! Hell yeah. Mega kill indeed, sir. We're not even fully stacked. Did we just win the game? I oh, know, boss is a uh, pretty high health. We might be able to end. Yeah, we, we've just ended. Neat. Okay, well. This bit, like I said, I, this build is the uh, my preferred Probius build. Didn't expect this game to go so well, to be quite honest. That went really well. Um, huh. Fair enough. But, um... Hmm. I don't know. I'd, I'd like to show you more of this style, of this build in general, but the fact is, what you saw is basically the entire strategy. Like, the later level talents really don't matter so much. Like, let me let me take you through the talent build and we'll do it that way and I'll explain what I think is the correct build, etc. Why I think that in general. Okay, so for starters, we did okay. Three deaths. It's reasonable. Only took one death because it is Haunted Mines for us to win the game. Um, okay, so Gather Minerals, in my opinion, definitely the best, especially against kind of cloaked characters, which uh, Valera and Zeratul, especially in quick match, are super popular at the moment. And Nova is always Nova, so someone's probably going to pick her in your ranked games. So, the, I, I, uh, for starters, I would recommend pr maybe not picking Probius in ranked until you're very comfortable with him, and until it's been a bit more figured out, like uh, once the pros have uh, got their heads around it completely. So remember, it usually takes pros like a couple of weeks, maybe, to get a hero properly figured out. Uh, turbocharged is what I would go with level 4. Shield capacitor seems tempting, and photo barrier if you are up against like big burst mages. Uh, but overall, turbocharged allows you to micro very effectively, and you're going to be fighting in pylon range all the time, because that's when you get mana. So the extra 20% passive movement speed is great, and of course, you have the reduced uh, pro brush cooldown, so you can just boost your way to lane quicker, which is always nice. Level 7, tower defense, you want to spam those turrets so that they can do lots of damage. Uh, the reason we're not focusing on the Q or the W uh, talents is because they're inconsistent. The enemies, it's very easy to dodge those, whereas the turret auto-targets, which kind of sucks compared to Gaslo, but it still gets some good value. So the cooldown reduction allows you to spam out those turrets. Like we said, pile and overcharge, you're making sure that you're fighting on your terms in your damage. I do like Nullgate, it's a really cool ability. That may appear on an episode of Try Hard at one point when I try to make it work. Uh, level 13, Shield Battery, because you want to keep your team alive and you want to keep yourself alive. So you want to stay in the pylon field and make it so that anyone who engages is going to have a really rough time killing anyone. Uh, level 16, I would usually take the uh, Quantum Entanglement so that they, if they do run into the area, you can drop one of these so that they get slowed on the way out so that they have a bit more trouble. And level 20, I would still go with the Construct Additional Pylons because more pylons equals more Photon Overcharge, which is lovely. And of course, the increased damage. So there you guys go. I hope you enjoyed this episode of All In. It, uh, very simple. There's only really two talents for this build. We will probably do a, I don't know, I, I really don't know where to put it, because there's a build I'd like to try, but it's not an all-in. Uh, I want to maybe try, like, Warp Resonance and combining that with Shoot'em Up. Not sure how I'd do it. We'll, we'll we'll work it out. We'll have a think about it. Yeah, we'll put, I'll, I'll have a think. I'll have a think and see what I can come up with. For now, though, guys, that has, that has been all. Remember, if you want to support me, you can subscribe to this channel. You can uh, turn off ad block on this channel if you want to be really nice and help me out. Even though uh, YouTube ad revenue is going down very aggressively at the moment due to YouTube making many mistakes. And uh, what's uh, there you go. I'm just being honest about it. Income, My income's being reduced drastically due to this. Uh, if you want to help with that, then you can support me more directly 
by going to uh, the Patreon link, which is in the description below. You can also come speak to me on Discord, which is also linked in the description below. I have been Tedja. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you all next time.